London is the capital of England, by far the most popular city in the United Kingdom, and the most popular city in the European Union. Home to more than 8 million people, London is the city of Faraday and Keats, of Bowie and Queen, is the city of Wembley, of Big Ben and Tower Bridge, of Black Cabs, The Tube, Bankers and Bohemians. In footballing terms, London is the birthplace of two of Britain's greatest footballers, namely Jimmy Greaves and Bobby Moore, also arguably the sport's most famous exponent worldwide, David Beckham. None of those three are still lacing up their boots now though, and this video is only concerned with current players and current ability. Now, this video, which had been requested a lot, like all of these videos, required hours upon hours of research, but there were still some burrows that proved to be challenging. If you think I've missed anyone or disagree with any inclusions, do let me know in the comments, it's perhaps inevitable, with a video as tricky as this one to put together. To be clear, it is based solely on where the player was born, there are 32 London boroughs in total, and there will be some honourable mentions for certain boroughs. Here are my views on the best footballer from every London borough. Barking and Dagenham Dean Marnie Getting us off to a flyer, it was a tosser between Barking born duo Dean Marnie and Darren Prattley for the London Borough of Barking and Dagenham. Both players played in League One last season, but whilst Prattley will be playing for Charlton in the Championship next season, and Marnie will still be in League One with Fleetwood, we think the former Premier League regular still just about edges it. Barnet Matthew Connolly The likes of George Michael and Elizabeth Taylor were born in the London Borough of Barnet, but we don't have quite such illustrious names to choose from on a footballing front. Cardiff City right-back Matthew Connolly, who came through the youth ranks at Arsenal, sees off Borussia Mönchengladbach youngster Keenan Bennett as our pick for Barnet. Bexley Liam Richwell It would be fair to say Liam Richwell's best days as a footballer are probably behind him but he's still the best player from Bexley at the age of 34. Once a regular in the Premier League with Aston Villa, Birmingham City and West Bromwich Albion, Ridgewell spent the second half of last season with Hull City, but the club chose not to extend his deal this summer, meaning he is currently a free agent. Brent Josh Murphy An obvious honourable mention here goes to Jacob Murphy, since both of the Murphy twins were born in Wembley in the London borough of Brent. Both wide players, both quick, and both good on the ball, Josh and Jacob began their careers together at Norwich City. Josh plays on the left at Cardiff City, whilst Jacob tends to play on the right and spent the second half of last season on loan at West Brom from Newcastle United. Bromley Jack Randall Obviously, we are going through the boroughs in alphabetical order, and I promise you, the quality of player does improve as we go along. Bromley is a new low though, and the best we can do is a 26-year-old free agent in the form of Jack Randall. Randall made his Aldershot Town debut at the age of 18, but suffered a leg break during a one-month loan spell at Didcot Town. He hasn't had a professional club since, and as you've probably guessed, we don't have any images of him in our database. Camden Thiago Alori Renowned for its fashion markets and alternative culture, the London Borough of Camden is the birthplace of Rod Stewart, Stephen Fry and Slash. It also sees a step up in class on a footballing front since former Portuguese youth international Thiago Alori was born in Hampstead. The former Liverpool man, who is Reading's second most expensive signing of all time, returned to sporting club to Portugal in January 2019. Croydon Emil Smith-Rowe Croydon has become increasingly trendy in recent years, and Arsenal midfielder Emil Smith-Rowe has certainly followed the trend of young English footballers in trying his hand in the Bundesliga. The 18-year-old spent the second half of last season on loan with third place to RB Leipzig, who apparently want Arsenal to let them have him on loan again next season. Ealing Chris Metham Now we're starting to see a bit of a step up in class, and we've another Premier League footballer for the London Borough of Ealing. Although he's already won six caps for Wales at the age of 21, £12 million Bournemouth signing Chris Beffham was born in the suburb of Greenford. An honourable mention here must go to Beffham's international teammate Hal robson Carnu, who will always be able to live off that turn and finish against Belgium at Euro 2016. Enfield Carl Walker-Peters A few years ago, Rhys Oxford looked like the finest young player born in the London borough of Enfield, but now, Cal Walker-Peters, who is actually two years older than Oxford, looks to be a brighter prospect. Walker-Peters has played 19 games for Tottenham to date, and he provided a hat-trick of assists in a single game against Bournemouth last season. Greenwich 
Chris Smalling. Maybe the toughest selection in this entire video, Chris Smalling hasn't had a great time at Manchester United over the last few years, but we still think he's the standout candidate for Greenwich based on pedigree. Blackburn Rovers star man Bradley Dack and Carlin Grant, who provided a rare spark in a disappointing Huddersfield side last season, deserve honourable mentions, as does Moses Odebajo, who'd be playing for a top-half Premier League team right now, were not for the awful injury he sustained at Hull City following promotion to the top flight. Hackney Bradley Johnson Hackney has seen plenty of gentrification in the 32 years since Bradley Johnson was born there in 1987. The powerful central midfielder, who has a cannon of a left foot, made his name in Yorkshire with Leeds United, but has been with Derby County since 2015. Hammersmith and Fulham Max Aarons It's a toss-up between two Hammersmith-born right-backs for the London borough of Hammersmith and Fulham, namely Norwich City's teenage star Max Aarons and West Ham's 26-year-old fullback Ryan Fredericks. Aarons may only be 19, but he was sensation in his breakout season for Norwich last season, reportedly catching the eye of Manchester United. He's our choice for Hammersmith and Fulham. Haringey Kobe Rowe We're back to scraping the barrel when it comes to Haringey, I must admit, and there are no professional footballers who were born there, as far as we know. The best I can do is Haringey Borough centre-back Kobe Rowe, who ran a marathon the day after playing for Haringey this year, and I'm not even entirely sure that he was born there, if I'm honest. Let us know in the comments if you can do better. Harrow Theo Walcott We've no such problems with Harrow, where Theo Walcott sees our fellow Premier League players like Kieran Clark and Adrian Mariapa to take top spot. Walcott was born in Stanmore before making his name in the Southampton Academy. He returned to London in a move to Arsenal at 16 years of age, but the 30-year-old winger now plays for Everton. Havering John Joe Shelby Born in Romford, John Joe Shelby spent time in the academies of Arsenal and West Ham before becoming Charlton Athletic's youngest ever player not long after his 16th birthday. He spent three seasons at Liverpool before being sold to Swansea for £5 million, who subsequently sold him to current club Newcastle for £12 million. Hillingdon Alfie Mawson Hillingdon-born centre-back Alfie Mawson had a brilliant few years following his move to Barnsley in 2015. Having starred for the Tykes, he was snapped up by Swansea City, and once the Swans went down, Fulham won the race to sign the uncapped Englishman for £20 million. Last season, things slowed down for the 25-year-old, who struggled with injuries, and he'll be back in the Championship next season. Hounslow Sonny Aluko While Sonny Aluko was born in England, but chose to represent Nigeria at international level, his sister Eni Aluko was born in Nigeria, but chose to represent England at international level. Sonny is a talented footballer who looked brilliant for Rangers and prior to his first injury at Hull City. That injury really knocked the stuffing out of him at a time when he had been the best player in the championship. He still became Reading's record signing before making a low move to Beijing Ren, but he's never truly been the same player since. Islington Andy Aden. With another London-born footballer who represents an African nation here, as Ghanaian international Andy Yadam sees off the challenge of Colombian-based midfielder George Saunders to be named as Islington's finest. The 27-year-old attack-minded fullback currently plays for Reading, having previously turned out for likes of Barnsley, Barnet, and Braintree. Kensington and Chelsea George Lawrence the smallest of all the London boroughs, the Royal Borough of Kensington and Chelsea is one of the most affluent and densely populated districts in the United Kingdom. Whilst it may fare well in terms of household income, it fares terribly in terms of giving birth to great footballers. We've come up short, I'm afraid to say, and the best we can do is form a Southampton and Bournemouth fulfilled at George Lawrence, who retired in the late 1990s. Kingston upon Thames Declan Rice a man whose nationality has caused a fair bit of controversy over the last 12 months, Declan Rice represented the Republic of Ireland at multiple youth levels and even won six caps for the senior team. He was born and raised in Kingston upon Thames though, and in February 2019, he switched his international allegiance over to England. The 20-year-old West Ham star is a talented defensive midfielder who should have a bright future in the game ahead of him. Lambeth Nathaniel Klein we have the choice of a couple of England international fullbacks for Lambeth, and it's Liverpool fullback Nathaniel Klein who beats West Brom left back Kieran Gibbs in the end. 
Klein spent the second half of last season on loan at Bournemouth, and it remains to be seen whether he'll stay at Liverpool this summer, with Trent Alexander-Arnold having nailed down that right-back spot for the Reds. Lewisham. Ruben Loftus-Cheek. This was a really difficult call between Chelsea midfielder Ruben Loftus-Cheek and Liverpool centre-back Joe Gomez. I suspect that if Gomez hadn't been injured for large parts of last season, he would be the standout candidate, and he could be a regular fixture in alongside Virgil van Dijk next season. Loftus-Cheek is equally capable of having a fantastic season if he is made a regular fixture at Stamford Bridge, though. A fantastic athlete who is brilliant on the ball and more than capable of hitting double figures in terms of goals from midfield, he needs to be starting every week at the age of 23. Merton. Glenn Little. We're struggling again with Merton, and it's back to a retiree being our best show. Talented Wimbledon-born Burnley legend Glenn Little is 43. But he had retired in 2016, so he should still be half decent at least. Newham. Mark Noble. It's a choice between Mark Noble and Jermaine Defoe for Newham, but with Defoe, aged 36 now and having been exiled by Bournemouth, we have to go for West Ham captain Mark Noble. Born in Canning Town, the 32-year-old has been with West Ham since the age of 13, and he's played 467 games and won the Player of the Year award twice for the Hammers to date. Redbridge. Reese James. A fantastic young footballer, Reese James has had a tremendous couple of years. He won the Toulon tournament with England in 2017, he was named as Chelsea Academy Player of the Year for 2017-18, and he won Wigan's Player of the Year award on loan with the Latics in 2018-19. The Redbridge-born 19-year-old is a terrific young talent, and if he can't get a chance at Chelsea in the next couple of years, then no one will. Richmond upon Thames. Ty Ashby Hammond. The home of English Rugby Union Stadium Twickenham and Kew Gardens, Richmond upon Thames hasn't been a wellspring of footballing talent in recent times. Our best shout is 20 year old Fulham goalkeeper Ty Ashby Hammond. Southwark, Jaden Sancho. The birthplace of possibly the finest Londoner of them all, Michael Faraday, Southwark also offers us plenty in the way of footballing talent. Tammy Abraham and Jordan Ibe are worthy honourable mentions, but Borussia Dortmund star Jadon Sancho is the obvious winner. The Camberwell-born starler is a Bundesliga and England star at the age of 19, and the world is at his feet right now. Sutton Ryan Taffazoli A former captain of the esteemed Southampton under-18 and reserve teams, Ryan Taffazoli never managed to break into the Saints' first team. He has since racked up more than 100 appearances for both Mansfield and Peterborough, but having left the posh at the end of last season, he is currently a free agent. Tower Hamlets Jack Payne Former Southend United star Jack Payne is our choice for Tower Hamlets. The talented young attacking midfielder played more than 20 games for Huddersfield Town as they won promotion from the Championship, but he was loaned out to Oxford, Blackburn and Bradford for their two seasons in the Premier League. Waltham Forest, Harry Kane. London's finest, and indeed England's finest right now, Waltham Forest is the London borough that gave birth to Harry Kane. A fantastic old school centre forward, Kane is one of the most prolific strikers in the world. He's already scored more than 160 goals for Tottenham, in addition to scoring 22 goals from 39 caps for England. David Beckham was also born in Waltham Forest, and both Becks and the two-time Premier League and one-time World Cup Golden Boot winner Kane attended the same school in Chingford. Wandsworth Callum Hudson-Odoi There must be something in the water in the London borough of Wandsworth, since although there isn't a truly outstanding candidate like Harry Kane, no other borough provided us with such a plethora of candidates. Honourable mentions must go to the likes of Reese Nelson, Mikel Antonio, Ryan Sessegnon and Adam Ola Luckman. Our choice is in-demand Chelsea teen Callum hudson Adoy. The 18-year-old has been outstanding in youth team football and he made 24 appearances for Chelsea last season, in addition to winning his first caps for England, as the Blues rebuffed a £35 million bid from Bayern Munich. Westminster Kadeem Harris I could be wrong, but I don't think any club has more players in this list than Cardiff City, and they've another with our final entry. 26-year-old winger Kadeem Harris was a bit part player for the club as they were relegated from the Premier League last season, but the former Wicked Wanderers man is still the standout candidate for the Borough of Westminster. Right, that's it for today's video. 
Thank you for watching. A very warm thank you to all of our London-based viewers and subscribers. I hope you enjoyed the video. Give us a like if so. And obviously make sure you're subscribed and have notifications turned on for HITC7s because there are rumours that every time someone doesn't subscribe to our channel, a puppy dies. So please do the ethical thing and save a puppy today.